This is where I would review the West Side Gun TV Boy, but that track seems to be slowly coming out. So let me just give you part two of my rant about the Buffalo style that has been mass produced and forced on people harder than Pepe Le Pew. This time let's look at it from a positive point of view if we can call it that. It seems today's generation has been spoiled with an abundance of anything that they desire. When I was young I had to go to Blockbuster once a week to get new entertainment while today Netflix to Crunchyroll has everything you could possibly want to watch right now. Even in a pandemic, people have yet to watch everything that those places have to offer. So it makes sense that these artists forego quality for quantity and build a presence just for the fact that they are there. How many streamers do you know whose stream is absolute crap but have a massive following because they are streaming all the time? You can't get money unless you are there to pick it up. It's really the next level of what Master P was doing back in the 90s when he released like what 20 plus albums a year and they would all sell at least 500,000 units going gold. Those numbers are no longer possible in this environment but that work ethic seems to have tripled. Griselda as a whole has been a hit of the curve in that facet. The closest thing to this amount of musical flooding would be that Best Rapper Alive campaign from Lil Wayne and that only lasted what? two to three years maybe? These guys are just now being widely known for this, but they have been flooding music for a while. We talking like around 2015, if not longer. Bravo for the work ethic. To make this sheer amount of music takes devotion on a deep level. My issue is that devotion has lasted longer than the passion for creativity. So instead of creating something unique, you have simply become the Ford Motor Company of music. Belting out songs on an assembly line so fast that you make defective tracks more consistently than hits. At this particular moment, you get away with it because you are technically still new to the masses. And as I said, this style suits this generation. But you know what else fits this generation? Moving on to the next more popular sound that is mass promoted or interesting in the moment. If you aren't prepared for the moment music shifts on you, then you will never recover. 